Hi. Hi, welcome to Savor Food and Life, where healthy recipes and great living come together. I'm Mark Daniels, Executive Chef at San Angelo Community Medical Center, and I have with me today a special guest. I have Rod Schumacher. How Good morning. You I'm well. How are you? I'm great. Let's I'm, cook. Uh, all right. I'm, I'm glad to have you on set uh, doing some different items. Today we're doing a play on uh, BLTs, where you can use it as a uh, a party appetizer, or you could use it uh, simply as uh, a healthier version of BLT at your house. Okay. Right? Without all the bread and, and, and carbs and things like that. Uh, the star of the show, the, in the name, Belgian BLT, right, is the Belgian endive. Okay? And so these are pretty easy. You can cut off the end, and then the leaves just peel off. Okay. Right? And so they end up being like this, and they're great um, vehicles or vessels to deliver whatever you want. So if you wanted to do like egg salad, tuna salad, chicken salad for parties, you could do it, and it's easy to uh, consume and handle for finger foods and, and whatnot. Uh, the flavor explosion, the different levels we're doing here is we're going to start with a, a chive mayo. Okay, so if I have you add in the mayonnaise. And to cut back on the fat even more uh, and less uh, fat and carbs in this dish, we're going to cut it with some Greek yogurt. All right. This is next. Yes, this is next. We're going to add it in there, and this will cut. This will cut it by 50 percent, and it also adds a different texture to it, kind of velvety. Uh, Dijon mustard. When we're doing recipes, we're trying to get different sensations, different flavor profiles. So uh, this gives that little bit of extra um, hit to it. A little acidity, so we have some lemon juice. A lot of times when you're cooking, you're missing something. It's usually some kind of acidity, whether it's tomatoes, <laughs> lemon juice, lime juice. And then it's a chive mayo, so we're going to add our chives to it. And then just a little bit of that salt, we're going to put the rest in our tomatoes. A little bit of pepper. There you go, perfect. All right. Looks like you've done this more than once. All right. Oh, we have Belgian endive all the time. All the time at your yeah. house, right? <laughs> it's a, it's the star of the show Pretty at your much. house, right? All right. So you can uh, stir that, incorporate it together. And we're going to add red wine vinegar with the salt and the pepper and with our tomatoes. Okay. And so you can do your tomatoes, you can do your mayonnaise a uh, day or two days ahead of time. Uh, if you have a lot of prep that you're doing for different uh, uh, events or you just want to make it ahead for yourself and eat it throughout the week, uh, it's perfectly fine. Okay, so we have our tomatoes and they're kind of marinating in that vinegar, salt, and pepper. Okay. Ideally, how, how long would you want them to marinate? You know, ideally, uh, about an hour. Good. All right, it's just so it's, it sorts of, sort of penetrates. And they'll hold, they'll hold uh, tomatoes three or four days. The mayonnaise will last five to seven days, okay? Um, these start to break down because of the vinegar amount in them. Um, the other piece to this, to our BLT, you got to have some kind of bacon, right? Mm -hmm. In this case, we're elevating it. We're using pancetta, and so it's an aged uh, bacon. So it has a little bit more of a punch to it, a crispiness to it. So we have some that's finished here. You can use uh, different types of cheese. You can use feta, queso cotija, uh, just regular uh, fresh shaven Parmesan. And this one, we're going to use feta cheese. All right. Okay. So in building this, okay, it's fairly simple. We're going to take a little bit of the mayonnaise and we're going to fill the inside. Feta cheese. Okay. Pancetta. And then put one of our oh, great tomatoes in there. And you'll build your platter throughout. And then I'm going to make one for you to taste. i got to have you All try right. it, right? And so everybody at home knows, 
I don't torture you. I've already asked you if you like all the ingredients in this, right? That's so, absolutely true. Now, you can get all these ingredients at the local supermarket. Absolutely. Okay. Um, some of them might be in smaller containers than what we get them, right? Because we get them in large amounts, but um, they absolutely do. Okay. Let's give that a try. All right. That's good. So you have that good crunchiness. Job of the yep. endive, the pancetta, saltiness mm -hmm. of the feta cheese, and then the finish with the, the, with the uh, grape tomato. Yes, sir. Well, Excellent. we enjoyed having you on the show today. We'll see you guys again next week. Thank you. Savor Food and Life, sponsored by San Angelo Community Medical Center.